guys and welcome back. So in today's video I will be showing you how to create this Shane Mitchell inspired makeup tutorial. In this picture she has a very glowy skin and a bright lip and a bluish green lower lash line. So if you would like to know how I recreated this look, just keep on watching. I was using the Zoeva graphic brows in Cineris and now I'm setting them in place with the sleek brow gel. carve out my eyebrows and prime my eyelids, I'm taking the Urban Decay Naked Skin Concealer in uh, Light Warm. And I'm going to blend that in using my Beauty Blender. Set that in place. I'm taking the NYX HD um, finishing powder with a Real Techniques brush. Now for the eyes, um, Shaysin, she's wearing a very neutral brown lid. I'm taking the Too Faced Natural Matte Palette. So I'm going to take this shade right here called Chocolate Cookie with a Bedellium Tools 785 blending brush and I'm going to put that in my crease and all over my lid So moving on to the face, I'm taking the Jouer Anti Blemish Matte Primer For foundation, I'm taking the Dior Skin Star foundation in 020 and I'm going to blend that in using my Beauty Blender. For concealer, I'm taking the Urban Decay again and I'm going to put that under my eyes, a little bit on my cupid as well, on my chin on my forehead, down the bridge of my nose, a little bit over here. Now for a little bit of a glow I'm taking the NYX Liquid Illuminator. So now I'm going to set everything in place with that NYX powder again, with this big fluffy brush. Now to bronze up the face, I'm taking the Florimar Terracotta Powder. So I'm taking these colors right here to bronze up my face with a MAC 150 brush For blush I'm taking the Zoeva Coral Spectrum palette and I'm going to take this shade right here with a Morphe M405 brush For highlight I'm taking that Florma um, bronzing uh, powder again and I'm going to take the lighter shade uh, with a Morphe M510 brush and I'm going to put that on the high points of my face with an even smaller brush I'm going to put that on my inner corners my brow bone Now moving back to the eyes, she has a very vibrant um, bluish green lower lash line so I decided to pick up my Morphe 35B palette and, uh, and I'm going to take a mixture of these three colors right here and blend them in in my lower lash line. Firstly going to pick up this shade right here with a Sigma pencil E30 brush. Mm -hmm. 
And then I'm going to take this color and this color right here. With a more fluffier brush, I'm taking the Sigma Airbrush Blender F63. I'm going to take this shade right here and I'm going to blend everything out. For my waterline, I'm taking the Colourpop Creme Gel Liner in Prance. For lashes, I'm taking the Eyler London Exaggerate in, in the style 143. For mascara, I'm taking the NYX Dye Mascara. And I'm going to put that on my upper and lower lashes. And finally for lips, I'm taking the Colourpop Ultra Matte Lip in Saigon. set everything in place. I'm taking the Gerard Cosmetics Slay All Day Setting Spray in Lavender. So yeah, there we have it with the finished makeup look. I really hope you guys enjoyed. I had so much fun recreating this Shea Mitchell look. If you guys enjoyed it, don't forget to thumbs up this video and subscribe to my channel and hopefully I will see you in my next video. Bye!